The Presto Precise Digital Pressure Canner is the first electric canner to meet USDA home canning guidelines for safely processing vegetables, meats, poultry, and other low acid foods. It also doubles as a boiling water canner. Both methods use recipes with standard processing times and temperatures as defined by the USDA. This step-by-step -step video guide will demonstrate the pressure canning method, but before using it for the first time, refer to the Getting Acquainted section of the instruction manual for directions on cleaning and assembling your canner before starting to can. Also included are specific instructions for pressure canning a wide variety of foods, including tomatoes, vegetables, meat, fish, even soups and stocks. Let's get started. Always use a research-tested recipe and never alter the ingredient proportions. Today, we're using the recipe for pressure canning carrots. Prepare the food exactly as directed in the recipe. We're using the raw pack method in quart jars. Gather the canning supplies you'll need. For information on preparing jars, lids, and bands, refer to canning basics in the instruction manual and online at gopresto.com. Now, turn to the pressure canning section of the instruction manual. Put the removable pot in the canner. Place the canning rack in the pot to prevent jar breakage and add three quarts of water, which will reach the bottom fill line. Use hot tap water to shorten the heating time. Fully insert the power cord and plug it in. Pressure can will flash. Press the control knob to select the pressure can mode. The timer display defaults to 10 minutes. Rotate the control knob to the processing time stated in the recipe. In this case, 30 minutes for carrots in quart jars. There's no need to adjust for altitude. Press the advance arrow. Insert jars will light up. Fill the jars half full with water to efficiently heat the jars for canning. Place them on the canning rack. Remove the regulator from the canner cover. Place the cover on the canner, aligning the install remove mark on the cover with the mark on the canner body and rotate to lock. Make sure the white gasket is on the temperature sensor. Lower the sensor arm and turn the green latch clockwise to lock in place. Press the advance arrow and the warm icon will light up. Jar warming will take about 20 minutes. During this time, assemble ingredients and equipment and complete food preparation according to the recipe. When the canner beeps twice, fill jars will light up. The jars are now properly warmed and ready to be filled. Unlock the green latch, lift the temperature sensor arm, and remove the cover. Lift out one jar at a time, discard the water from the jar, and immediately fill the jar with carrots, leaving one inch headspace. Add one teaspoon canning salt to the jar if desired, and add boiling water, again, leaving one inch headspace as directed in the canning recipe. All recipes will indicate the amount of headspace necessary for the food being canned. Headspace is the airspace between the top of the food or liquid and the lid. It's important to release air bubbles from the jar and to wipe any food particles or liquid from the jar rim. Then position a flat lid. Using your fingertips, screw the band onto the jar until resistance is met. Do not over tighten as air must release from the jars during processing and cooling. Place the filled jar straight down onto the canning rack and repeat the process until all the jars are filled. Place the cover on the canner, aligning the install remove mark on the cover with the mark on the canner body and rotate to lock. Lower the temperature sensor arm and turn the green latch clockwise to lock in place. The regulator should not be on the cover during the venting phase. Press the advance arrow and the heat icon illuminates. When the proper temperature is reached for venting, the vent icon will light up and the timer automatically begins to count down. Venting is required when pressure canning. Air that is trapped in the closed canner must be replaced with steam to assure safe home canning. When the venting time is done, the digital canner will start beeping and put regulator on will illuminate. Follow the prompt and carefully place the regulator on the vent pipe so the lever points to can. Press the advance arrow to proceed to the canning phase. At this point, the can icon will light up. The processing time set earlier appears, and the canner continues to heat. If the air vent cover lock did not lift during venting, air and steam will continue to release until it lifts. Once the required canning temperature is reached, the unit will beep twice, canning will illuminate, and processing begins.
The timer will count down. The Presto Precise Digital Pressure Canner holds the exact processing temperature automatically. There's no need to watch or adjust settings. When the time expires, the canner beeps four times. The cool icon will light up and the cooling phase begins. The length of the cooldown period will depend on the canner load and may take up to an hour and a half. The timer will then display 10 minutes for the final cooldown and will start to count down. When the cooling time expires, the canner will beep 10 times and the done icon will light up. Press and hold the cancel button for three seconds. Confirm the air vent cover lock has dropped. Then unlock the green latch. Lift the temperature sensor arm and remove the cover. Using a jar lifter, carefully remove the jars by lifting straight up and placing them upright on a towel. Do not retighten the bands. Allow the jars to cool naturally for a minimum of 12 hours, but no more than 24 hours before testing to see if a vacuum seal has formed. To check the seals, press down on the lid. It should be concave and not flex up and down when pressed. If a jar fails to seal, it will audibly flex up and down. Refer to canning basics in your instruction manual for a remedy. You now have five quarts of pressure canned carrots, beautifully preserved using the Presto Precise Digital Pressure Canner. Be sure to read the instruction manual and recipe carefully before each use. The Quick Start Guide is also a helpful reference tool. More canning information is available at gopresto.com. For a step-by-step -step video guide of the boiling water canning method using the digital pressure canner, watch the companion video.